Hey everyone and welcome back to another episode of the GT Online Top 5 Community Plays. Today's episode is a wild card, which means we have many different types of clips, there's no central theme. Next week we're going to be doing a kills with ground vehicles theme, so that means anything from a tank, a half track, weaponized Tampa, even things like the scramjet count as well, even though you're boosting in the air with those. But pretty much anything that you consider a ground vehicle is allowed. And if you are interested in that theme, the instructions to send me a clip are down below in the description of all my videos. Starting off at number 5 is Patero93, and he uses a creative combination to take out a Deluxo. This is the kind of stuff that you only see in GTA, a vigilante inside the back of a bambushka using homing rockets to take out attackers. And the vigilante is actually a really clever choice here because it doesn't have a minimap icon, so that Deluxo probably didn't even know what hit him at that moment. Very creative takedown. At number 4 is Melvin1717, and this is a fairly long clip of a Charnabog hunting prey in its natural habitat. So you're probably wondering why didn't the jets just go and strafe the Charnabog to destroy it? Well, they were actually doing a one-on-one -on -one deathmatch so they could keep spawning jets over and over again, which is what you guys saw in the gameplay. And while you are in a one-on-one -on -one deathmatch, you can't see anyone else on the radar. I've actually had people do this against me and the Charnabog works so good against it. It just makes light work out of the jets because they don't expect it coming at all. I really wish the Charnabog had off-radar capabilities because its main downside is that if you know where the Charnabog is, it's so easy to take out and avoid the missiles, but if you get locked onto randomly and don't know where the missiles are coming from, it makes it much more difficult to deal with. At the number 3 spot is Legotron 9 with a nasty free aim scramjet shot. That was from so far away, and at the same time, he had to lead it a bunch to hit the target who was driving down the street. I always love seeing the scramjet being used for PvP, it's just such an awesome vehicle, and the kills that people get with it are always so much fun to watch too. Coming in at number 2 is Michael DK 25 with an amazing jet takedown. The amount of prediction to pull this off is pretty impressive, he shot it knowing that the jet would come in and go for a strafe at his friend, and the jet of course just flew right into the RPG as he went down for the kill. I'm sure it looked really cool from his friend's point of view too, just seeing the jet blow up out of nowhere before he got shot at with the cannons. And taking the top spot this week is Coca-Cola Flies in the Starling. He shot the other player out of the Starling while flying backwards. That is some next level skills in the Starling right there. I like the Starling vs Starling dogfight match as well, that's awesome. You know, we've seen a lot of laser dogfights where the one jet flies backwards and takes the other one out, but I don't think I've ever seen the Starling shooting someone out of the cockpit while flying backwards after stalling, so that was sick. But that is going to be all for this episode of the Top 5 Community Plays. Let me know which clip was your favorite in the comment section down below. Again, next week's theme is going to be kills with ground vehicles, and the instructions to send me a clip can always be found in the description of all my videos. If you enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like, as well as subscribe to my channel for more guide and PvP-related content. 
And as always, thanks for watching and have a great day.